Welcome to episode 10. The big one. Till we get to a bigger one. Um, there's only one thing that can um, that can help us celebrate. And it's lucky the wheel picked it last week, isn't it? Because this week we're looking at some, a handful of the games that Donkey Kong has appeared in. Yes, Donkey Kong. Um, as you can see, here, here, here is Donkey Kong. And uh, what's cool about this is that you can do this with it and go, oh, oh, doesn't you? Oh, look at that. Oh, what? Wow. Isn't that cool? Ah. Uh, I'm still not paying £19 for it, but it still is cool. I like it. Anyway, it's time for me to shrink down there. Uh, so you can see the big screen. So let's do that. Okay, we're good to go. Uh, not sure why the chat box isn't showing any chat, but let's not worry about it. It might just show some in a bit. Ah, we're going to start with the ColecoVision Donkey Kong. We're going to start with, with a couple of Donkey Kongs, the game you all know and love, Donkey Kong. Um, we're going to start with... Actually, we might be better starting with the game... Um, um, no, let's start with ColecoVision, because that's the, the older of the two. We can look at the Game Boy, game Boy 1 afterwards. So... Let me make sure you can see it. It is a... Something I forget every now and again. Ah, and as we're opening, only opening one window at a time, it might be a little longer getting between games, but I'll know what game we're looking at. Okay. More like vision screen, you're far too big. Oh, thank you, Nutty Cluster in the chat room for for whatever that is. <laughs> um, we've uh, we've just made it to affiliate, and um, there's obviously there's lots of things that I don't know anything about. So um, I think they're bits. I think they're bits. So thank you. Okay, uh, let's see if my, uh... so just just so you know, before the show, well, the show was supposed to start 15 minutes ago, um, my machine crashed, as it's wont to do every now and again, so I'm happy that my new one's arriving tomorrow. Woo! Okay. Oh, yes. Which is my jump button. There we go. So, Donkey Kong, the, the... Classic Donkey Kong. Um, originally supposed to be a Popeye game. Then they lost the license for Popeye. Um, so, because that girl there was supposed to be Olive Oil. Hey. Um, yeah, they lost the license, so it became it became this. Um and then there's there's some suggestion that it was supposed to be King Bastard. Supposed to be King Kong. But they weren't allowed to use King Kong. That's how we ended up with Donkey. Whoop. Oh. I was going for the hammer. I mean I suppose. Technically, we should really dig out uh, Retro Arc and have a look at the arcade, the official arcade game. Um, obviously, on a vertical screen rather than a horizontal one. Oh, there we go. Ah! Oh, that was a bit faster than I expected. I'm a did. Oh. Um. Oh. Oh crap. I 
Okay. Okay. Just get me eye in. Just get me eye in. Um, if, if uh, well, if you're a fan of Donkey Kong, you'll have already seen it, but there's a, a brilliant documentary um, about the arcade game itself called King of Kong, about the fight for the... Um, burn bollocks. About the fight for the high score for Donkey Kong, which is uh, pretty good. It's worth watch. Right. So I'm dead. Proper dead. And what we're going to do is we're going to have another go. Uh, how do we reset this? Oh, I'll tell you what, I'll just hit the reset button instead. So uh, the Clecovision actually came, this was the cartridge, it was packed with, it was a big selling point. Um, so I think everybody's got this. Okay. There you go. If you go part way up and stop, you get up the ladders quicker. Oh. Ah, oh, hello, Springs from Salts. Welcome to the chat room. Nice to see you. To see you. Nice. Did a lot better the first time I tried it. <laughs> so you no doubt heard me oh, mention about how, how a lot I used to play a lot um, when I was younger. This was my console, and it feels like. My brain remembers what I should be doing, but my muscles don't. Like, you know, jumping too late and shit like that. It's like, I was really good at this in the day. And you just, you lose it. You just forget. I suppose if I played it as much now as I did then, then we would, wouldn't have an issue. Yes, thank you, Nutty Cluster. I can see. I know. My muscles have aged. Oh! Dagnabbit! Can't even remember if this version's got another level, or whether it's just... He's repeating. Got to have a little bit of... Uh... No one's going to come anywhere near me, are they? There we go. Eat that. Come on, I just want to <laughs> get through all the levels. Oh, I'm running out of time. There is another level. Okay. Obviously, if we've got any um, super Donkey Kong players who are watching this, I'm not following any strategy, but you didn't expect that anyway, did you? Um, okay, so we it's possible we might uh, come back to that um, later, because... But, but maybe on the arcade, we might 
Retro Arch was acting a bit funny earlier on, so I can't promise anything, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. Uh, okay, let's have a look at, before we move on to the sequel, let's have a look at Donkey Kong on the Game Boy. Sounds horrible. You can't hear it. Oh, and I can't see. Where is it? Come on. Pop it in the middle. Okay, so the title is Donkey Kong. Let's see what we've got. See, if we're creating a save file, does that suggest to you this is Donkey Kong that we've just played? No, it doesn't. But it is! Why do you need a save file? Now to be fair, you don't get that screen in the ColecoVision version, do you? It's got the flaminess like the... Um, oh, took too early. Like the arcade game. the 8-bit do pro so it should have all the buttons needed to play a bloody um, game boy you would hope oh no I just don't have the skills that's what it is I feel like I should die now and just uh, we'll start again from scratch oh wasn't expecting that Well, I don't know. I got through all that lot. Ah, oh, referee jumped over it and jumped back into it. I wish it'd stop doing that. We're back to my um, D-pad controller moans. Flame's gonna get me now, innit? Didn't think I'd have so many problems playing a frigging Game Boy version of Donkey Kong. What the? Oh, at last.
Okay, do I need to press something? Oh, yes I do. Oh, okay, I haven't played this before. Uh, I don't really know what I'm doing. Okay, right, so we have... Can I climb? No. So, like the normal... Normal game, I can't actually climb ladders. And... All right. Perhaps should have got the one up, but... Okay, so this is similar to the one we looked at before. it's got four stages right so this is the one that I didn't do very well on last time I look like it was there. a tiny bit of scaffolding to get on. Oh, whoa. whoa. Uh, yes, chat room, I should be collecting the one-ups if I wanted to have more lives, yeah? Oh, it's in a different castle. Literally is in a different castle. <laughs> I'm not doing anything with this, this is just all a cutscene. So, one assumes we'll repeat the same platforms again. This is why you have a save. Big city. Oh, I've just started the same. Oh no. Oh. Now what? Okay, so I've got another button to press, which apparently picks up keys. Oh. 
This feels like that. Oh, I don't know where we're going now. Not that way! Oh, perhaps could have gone. Oh, yeah. Alright. Yeah, this the um it feels like the the arcade Donkey Kong part of the game is just a Trojan horse for the rest of the game that they've put on this cartridge. No, 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 no! Dag, nabbit. Whoa! Shit. I mean, look at how many different levels there are. We won't be playing all of them, don't worry. Doing bloody handstands, or should we just get out of there? Oh, can I not climb up there if. Oh. Okay, so how am I supposed to get. I'm not allowed to climb up ladders while I'm holding a key. No, 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 Right. So, do I need to go somewhere else first? Can't see anywhere. What's this? Nothing there. <clears throat> but I can't climb ladders. <sighs> Alright, I guess the answer's that one, but how do I get over here now? Time, hell surprise. But if I get it to there, right. So then, this is something up here I need to get first. It's a bit demoralising when it's like a game for kids and you can't work out how it works. <laughs> right, so you can stand on these people and you can climb up these. But why would you? Well, what's the point? Um, if you're shouting at your screens at the moment, like live, then feel free free to drop it in the chat room. Um, and if you're watching on YouTube, then put it in the comments. I'd be curious. If you're a Donkey Kong Game Boy expert, what am I doing wrong? Let's 
still jump, just can't use ladders. But I need to get... Mm. Right, is the ladder... Right, oh, so how can I... Is it something to do with the mice? No, I think we're done with this. We're done. We're going to play the sequel to Donkey Kong now. Not sure why that's still there, but that's not the one we're playing. So the the actual sequel to Donkey Kong um, was Donkey Kong Junior, where all of a sudden Donkey Kong um, is the good guy, and Mario, the mean 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 man, who's saying caged him in a cage. That's what you do. Um, just hanging off the screen a little bit. That should probably do it. Um, and your little Donkey Kong, and you're going to save your old man. And I had this one as well. And I'm just going to be careful about saying how well I played it because I can't play it that well now. See? You swing along the vines and you knock down the fruit to... Um... Nope, not that one. Oh, crap. That's like Pac-Man. Oh. So I'm not sure that Mario even had a name yet still in Donkey Kong. Um, oh, crap bags. Uh, chat room, how old were you in 1982? Well, nutty cluster. I think you're asking because you know, but I was 12 in 1982. At the tail end of 1982, I was 11, mostly. Um, yes, yes, not a cluster. We know you were six. putting me off with your age-related shenanigans. Got there's a key. Hey. Oh, didn't move fast enough. So it's not the one I wanted to jump on. We'll play that again. Anyway, so I think Mario was called Jumpman. Still, by Donkey Kong 2. I don't think he was... Uh, Donkey Kong Jr. I don't think he was called Mario yet. Thank you. 
Quick! Oh! You slow baby. Um, do you know what? I'm just going to make that a little bit fittier on the screen for you. There we go. Right, it should be straight run, shouldn't it? Fra. See, with these, if you go like this and stretch two, you move faster, but you can't get out of the way quicker. Arrgh. Stitch that, you blue snappers. So you think, and now you've got birds to watch and all. And I assume you've worked out, you just push the chains up to... Um, that's very King Kong. Isn't it with all the all the chains around his there you go. Hmm. Uh, and then it's back to this. Now I can't remember if in the arcade there were more phases, stages. Yeah. Here we go. Oh, I can't remember what this one is. Oh, it's hoping it go a bit nearer. a lot quicker way of doing it but oh tits <laughs> impatience I shouldn't have died. I landed on the platform. Stupid baby ape. Oh! Stupid adult math. <laughs> oh, bollocks. Okay. That was Donkey Kong Jr. A role reversal with Bad Bad Mario. Boo. Uh, so after... Donkey Kong Jr. And obviously the, the arcade went crackers with clones and stuff like that. Um, specifically Crazy Kong, which got into trouble. Um, but I first played this on a holiday in Spain in the 80s. And I was like, what? What? Donkey Kong? But what's going on? It's totally insane. Um this is the NES version of it. Oh, excuse me. And this is um, Donkey Kong 3. 
which to say it's a, a departure um, is somewhat of an understatement. So, where are you, Donkey Kong 3 window? Come to daddy. There we go. Let's see how it fits the telly. Oh, it's huge. There we go. I think that will probably do it. So, Donkey Kong 3 has more of a horticultural <laughs> feel to it. Um, so, you shoot the bees, or hornets, or whatever they are, but you also shoot Donkey Kong up the ass. And, oh, and you stop the bees, wasps, hornets, murder hornets, probably. You stop them from stealing your um, stuff. Oh, and you don't run into them. Uh, yes, nutty cluster. They're, they're actually not nuts, but yes, it does look like you do have to bang the nuts. Well, if you if you get him high enough, he drops. Oh look! Oh, I keep running into him. There we go. That's a shot game, wasn't it? Let's play again. And again, your Donkey Kong is the, not the good guy, but he's not nicking your plants like the others. Not patient. Not patient. So it's kind of a bit... Galaxian, a little bit like we covered last week. Oh, it's got a bit of a tendency to go up when I'm. <sighs> See, this is jump pushing up to jump, so with the D-pad being as sensitive as it is, I'm occasionally jumping when I'm not supposed to. Thing is, I'm concentrating too much on the flies now. There you go, and if you shoot him off the top, the beehives fall down and all the bees are dead. It's not a very good environmental message, but especially with all the uh, we uh, insecticide you're shooting. Come on, come on! Not quite sure what the music's for now, but... Oh, come on, come on. Oh, I wanted to see him get his head in that beehive. So we're going to have to have another go, and I'm going to have to try and be more patient. I wonder what game B is. Ooh. Not going to know, because I can't select it for some reason. Thank you. 
That was quick. A bit of a samber or something going on there. Did we get a third level? No, back to the same one. Oh well. Oh, you see, now we've got someone that need it in twice. Oh, those things kill you, do they? Oh, shit. Uh, so there you go. That's, uh, that's Donkey Kong 3. Oh, we should see if we can find it. How do we select a different game? Aha. We press select. So it's game 2. Game B. What does that involve? Doesn't look any different so far. Is it just more difficult or Or is it because I've only got four plants? Oh no, gonna lose a plant. I think it's just harder. I think there's more things that you have to kill. Oh, you slimy little dirtbag. Um, right, okay. There you go. So, we've done Donkey Kong, Donkey Kong Jr., Donkey Kong 3. Now, we're into um, a whole different style of Donkey Kong game. Uh, which way are we are going to do this? Let's do this in order of age. So, we're going to Game Boy... We're going back, back to Game Boy. Um, they have a lot of Donkey Kong games on the Game Boy. Um, in fact, they have, I think they've got three or four different versions of this game that we're going to play now. But we're going to play Donkey Kong Land. Uh, never played it before. I don't know what it is. But um, that's why we're here, isn't it? To uh, see some old games that we didn't know about. Okay. Okay, it looks better on the screen you're looking at than the one I'm looking at. <laughs> okay. <sighs> so what is this? What sort of game is it? It's a lot better played at a smaller screen level. Uh, the thing is, if I make it smaller for me, it makes it smaller for you too. There we go. Let's try again. <sighs> okay. 
Okay, so we're walking from side to side. We're moving things that might hurt us. Whoa. And we're picking up barrels. Oh, we're not jumping into snakes. Right. So do we have something that's not jump? We've got roll. That's it. Roll, roll and jump. So maybe we have to roll through this. Oh, okay. Maybe it doesn't do anything. Oh. Oh, I see. Just let out Diddy Kong. Oh, more nanas. see now I'm riding the rhinoceros never and didn't think that would be happening tonight what's that can I do it again nope no oh, can I not get the barrel if I'm riding a rhinoceros um, so I'm just looking at the chat room uh, sorry be uh, naughty cluster it's um, the Game Boy can't get off of, can't seem to get off the rhinoceros now though. So that. Oh, you do it by dying. That's how you get off it. That's what happens to bloody um, Diddy Kong? Why? Whoa, whoa, shit! Wow, it looks like the console crashes when you bleed. When you die, everything just goes white. You're dead. Uh, On. Am I going to get Spell Kong? Am I? Yes, I am. Hurrah! Finished the level. Diddy Kong now. What? Oh, I don't know what that is, but it's fly. Is it a flying pig? It's a flying pig, and it hurts, apparently. I think I should have got that balloon. Oh, that bounced me right into the mouth of whatever that that thing is. One assumes there's a story attached to this or something. Oh, missed that balloon again. I'm gonna get another chance because I'm dead. Oh no, I'm not. did it again. 
price of bacon has gone up. God, how many lives are on this? Come on! Oh, double bloody balloon! Apologies for being distracted, that was the, uh, the courier saying my new Mac's arriving tomorrow. Uh, right, I'm done with that, it doesn't look very pretty, and it keeps bouncing me into the mouths of things. So um, that was Donkey Kong Land. I have a horrible feeling the rest of these are going to be a bit like this, because we're moving to the Game Boy Advance, and it's not a land anymore, it's, it's a country. Donkey Kong Country. So, let's swap over to Donkey Kong Country uh, on the Game Boy Advance and um, see how that plays. Oh, bigger screen this time though. Oh, it feels more widescreen, the Game Boy Advance. Okay, so then... Rareware! How are we fitting on the screen? Yeah, we're looking all right. Really? I've got to put my name in? Really? Oh, where's... Oh, little buddy. As part of your hero training, you've got to stand guard over my bananas. I'll relieve you at midnight as payment for looking after my bananas. I ain't reading that. So... Oh, these look similar to the animals that we were fighting in the last one. Donkey Kong sounds after your nanas. Is it a big surprise? Or is it a big shock? Yeah, yeah, you see, they're gone. They're gone. That's not a surprise. A surprise is supposed to be a nice thing. All right, we get the gist. Right, where are we going? Okay, so similar game. In fact, very, uh, very the same game. It's just more colorful. How do I jump up there and get that banana? A uh, balloon is what I meant. Was there something up there I should have got? Oh, yeah. Oh, I can't get it. There we go. Oh! I thought I could at least jump on it. Is that for us? Hey, a golden, golden goose? It's either a goose or a camel. Oh! 
secret level? Miss the balloon though. Ropey Rampage. Get lost, it's a bloody armadillo. Training and all. Get that coming. That's annoying. Can't leave it. I've got to go back for it. Whoa! No, no, no! Do I at least have the Kong now and I don't need to... No, I have to go back for it. Oh! Does the shit jump? armadillos. Crunchy on the outside. Oh, they're rotating the crap out of me. Jumping too soon. Oh, I thought, yes, yes, it would. Bloody armadillo was going to do me a favour, and it didn't. Uh, I don't know if anybody pays any attention to the chat that uh, that goes on just just up here um but the advert that nutty cluster is talking about is an advert for dime bars with harry enfield um just look it up on youtube crunchy on the outside soft on the inside armadillos uh right that's enough um countries and lands and, 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 and do you know what do you know what i have a horrible feeling that this next one is going to be very similar uh it feels like they um they decided i know what we're going to do with donkey kong no more climbing up skyscrapers we're going to have him running through jungle Because we're moving on now to, if I can find the window, 
Nope, it's not there. We're going to go on to Donkey Kong 64. And we're going to see what uh, on earth the 64, the okay. N64. Okay. Um, we're going to see if it's a uh, country ish, which I suspect it is. It's one of those that I vaguely remember because I used to have an N64. Let's find out, shall we? Yes, I know, I know, chat room, that there's there's no Donkey Konga. Um, because we've seen how I play rhythm games. Badly. And I don't have anywhere to stick in the, the, um, the drums. So now Donkey Kong raps. No, not here, he doesn't. Right, so I'm placing my bets now. I think we're looking at a 3D polygon version of what we've just been playing. That would be my guess. Let's have a look. We might not be here very long. Uh, shit, so, so much to do and think about. Uh, oh, oh, it's N64, isn't it? I don't have the right controller. Right, I'm not sure what's going to happen here, then. So I do have two analog sticks. And I have a range of buttons, but I don't think I've got enough buttons... For N64 control. Now you'll notice it's widescreen now. It doesn't fit properly on my retro CRT. Pirate seals. No, not workmen and tools, chat room. I'm like explaining the actual <laughs> physically don't have enough buttons on this to play night N64 games. I'm not sure, I, I mean, there must be a Bluetooth version of a pad for the N64 that I could connect to my Mac, one would assume. Short 8 bit do do one. It's an awful lot of story on this that don't seem able to uh, skip past. Oh, that fader. Start and pressing buttons. Okay, game 
starting. Is it? One assumes as I've created a safe slot that if we ever, we're not, but if we ever put this on again, we don't have to watch this again, surely. I want you to do everything in your power to keep Donkey Kong distracted. Steal that hoard of Gordon Banana's interests so much and take care of his pathetic friends. This time there can be no mistakes. Oh, your excellency, we've already taken care of business. <laughs> I hope for yours, you're right this time. No. While you'll be busy looking for your precious golden bananas, leaving friends, I'll be preparing my lizard-flavored surprise. Ah, uh, one handy push ups. Oh, right. Planky push ups. Hey, I feel we might be almost, almost about to play some game. Okay, so what have we got? Right. Right. Analog zooms in and out. We've got a jump. We've got a, a slap. Oh, I like the slap. <laughs> Alright, so that's it. So then what do the shoulder buttons do here? Oh, what's that? Is that high? Oh. Okay. D pad does nothing. Nothing. So, well, let's go outside and see what happens. Cranky then. Oh, is there some sort of? Oh, oh no! I'm gonna have to use both sticks to. How do I look around? Right, right now. Okay, what we're we doing here? Dead end. There was no need for me to come down here. Nope. Okay, what's that? That was not a good start. So it feels like the starting a maze runner where we're we're in a, a walled off area. Oh, so we have to go to Cranky, don't we? Did it say? Cranky's lab. Now, is that this way? Oh, oh, look, there he is. Let's go in and have another cutscene. Oh, I wonder if they were trying to make a Donkey Kong 64 cartoon and just like, oh no, we don't have enough money for that. Let's just make it into a game and. I mean, I know I probably should be reading these, but... Silly 3D quest, not a truer word, has been spoken. <laughs> oh. So that was pointless anyway. Go see Cranky, but then, no, you've got to go to the... The 
train in barrels. How can I turn all the way around? Where's the train in barrels? Where are they? The um I, I am not blaming my tools, but there is not really... Unless this was actually how it was on the N64, there's not a very good camera control. I don't really know how to move my... So one would assume we're going to the train. Oh, hang on. No. Can we... There we go. This is going to end badly. Press Z. You having a laugh? I wonder if that's Z then. It's not like it's not letting me dive down. I look like I'm dead. Oh, I can't get back out either. Oh no. Um. <laughs> okay. Shit. Um, I think what I might have to do when I after putting some time trying to map the correct buttons. So I obviously need a Z. Um, and we can't do any of this without a Z. Might not need a Z for this one. Pick up the oranges and oh. uh, I I I don't have the buttons. I just don't I don't have the buttons. So um that actually was our last console Donkey Kong game. So we're gonna have a bit of a bit of a tech monday session as we're gonna switch now and i think i might shut down open mu so it doesn't confuse the issue and then we'll open retro arch and what we'll do is we will explore now i've just updated it so that maybe that's why it's not uh, not happy. Okay, so we'll do Donkey Kong. Uh, so what I shall do is I'll switch to this one. Hello. And we'll capture RetroArch. And I, do, I need to spend a bit more time with RetroArch. And now is as good a time as any. Um, but obviously if you prefer to just watch me play games uh, rather than trying to work stuff out then let me know um, and we can not it's fine okay so there's the retro arch window now it's going to change when I put an arcade um, option in it so okay so let's have a look Okay, so this, you're going to see a lot of what we've um, what we've already looked at and what we've been playing. Um, oh, 
let's just try the the arcade version. Let's see what we get, shall we? Oh, press the wrong button. Retro Arch has different button set. And with um, RetroArch, basically, um, it runs on cores. So you have a what's called a core for each system or arcade machine in this case. Um, and you have to pick a car to run it on. So, I think that one will probably do. Right. Grab your butt. Let's see what happens. ROM set unknown. Tits. Okay. So, let's go back. Let's. Uh, Set it to that instead and try a different car. See what happens. Hmm. Hmm. It's thinking, it's thinking. Not sure what it's thinking, but it's thinking. I'm going to say. It should have come up by now. What was that? Was that? Oh, it was, oh, let's try that version of Mame instead. So it's a little bit more fiddly, but RetroArch does cover a, a lot of stuff that, I mean, OpenMU doesn't cover any get any arcade at all. Oh, it's not doing it, is it? Balls. Now it's a Game Boy. Let's try set two. No. How disappointing. I don't really want to... I wanted to play the arcade version, really. Mm -mm, mm -mm. I mean, I suppose we could have a look at the arcade version of Donkey Kong Jr. quickly. Oh, and if we're doing that, should we play the easy version? Let's see what we get. I mean, I did have a... I mean, it might not be... It might be that RetroArch is just um, not very well at the moment because uh, I just did an update on it and it didn't... Yeah. So not very well, it's just crashed. Oh, oh, RetroArch. Mm. Yeah, it's not very happy. Uh, so while I'm just, um, if the... What we should do is try something that's worked in the past. And then I'll have some idea if it's actually working or not. Oh, okay. So, it is Donkey Kong 3, and I know we've played that to death, but I just uh, had to find out. So, let's just have a crack, make sure it works properly. And then... Uh, 
try somewhere else. Oh, they're all different as well, I don't know. Oh, there we go, that's a bit. Now, they feel like they're a bit slower, but they also feel like... There's more of them. See, the worms, bloody, um, oh. don't know what they're supposed to be, but I've got one right in the face. Can you hear it all right? Yeah, you can. That's the one. They feel like they come a bit faster than they are on the N64, N NS, NES version. Oh. There we go. Game over. Yeah. I don't... It must have been a rubbish uh, high score if uh, I just got a high score with that. Oh, and the retro just crashed again. I think that's a sign. That's a sign that says don't use RetroArch. It needs looking at. It needs to be updated and looked at. Oh, yes. Um, so, we need to switch back to this one. No, this one. There we go. Um, well, do you know what? I think... I think that's probably it. Um, I did think we'd be playing uh, the the later games more. Um, I thought they would be uh, better, but but they're not. Oh, not not for me. I mean, you know, each to their own. You like what you like. Uh, Donkey Kong for me was always the um, the arcade game. So once it started drifting away, like a grumpy old man, I said, "That's not for me." Um, let's have a. Let's just. Uh, I've just reopened Open MU again, just to see if there's anything else that um, is worth having a look at, and. Uh, there's not. So unless we have, um, unless we have any requests from the chat room, we're moving into request section. Uh, is there any games that anybody wants to see on the eight bit, sixteen bit consoles? Then, um, then I'm happy to have a look at uh, at them to see see what we have. But we have played all the Donkey Kong that we're going to play tonight, I think. Ah, oh, right. So I know there's a little bit of a delay on the chat room. So do you know what? I think while we wait, uh, we're gonna we're gonna do the wheel. We're gonna do the wheel. Um, it's probably not hijacked since I've just had a crash. So, uh, one second while we get the wheel. Oh, Michael McIntyre, you have a lot to answer for. Uh, where are you? Wheelie, wheelie, wheel. Wheelie, wheel. Wheelie, wheel. How annoying. Okay, so we're ten episodes in. You know the wheel by now. It's going to tell us what we're going to be playing on episode 11. Let's give it a spin. I'm not going to explain what's on it. 
Alrighty then, let's have a look. Ooh. Horror games. You can only see genre there, but horror games, that's what we'll be playing. Wow. Okay. So I think that'll probably be a, a more than all oh, all these, all these go off the wheel, but then they'll come back on for a second part at some point. Um, because these these topics are just too big to cover. So that's probably what will happen. Horror games. Hmm. Um so I'll probably be looking at things that don't take a long time. We might do a little bit of Resident Evil, perhaps, if I can find a good. But I know there's uh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre on Friday the 13th on the Atari VCS. I'm sure they'll be spooky. Um, Splatterhouse springs to mind. I think there's a Nightmare on Elm Street on one of the consoles. So, uh, and of course... If you have any horror games from the 16-8-bit, 16-bit, 32-bit era, you can always email us. Um, you can email us at a Snug Radio. No, not Snug Radio. That's a different show. You can email us at retro at snugradio.co.uk. That's retro at snugradio.co.uk. It doesn't have to be suggestions for next week. It, it could be anything. Just drop us a line. Um... You can watch edited versions of these on YouTube on our channel, Snug Radio. We have the website, snugradio.co.uk. And um, they follow us on TikTok and all those sorts of things. Um, the chat room's just saying, is Ghostbusters horror enough? The old Ghostbusters games are a bit rubbish. We might look at if we can find a Ghostbusters 2 or something like that. Uh, a NES or a SNES version, but I would I would put that in. Um, besides, if it's a good game, we'll just put it in anyway. Uh, so, yes, do all the things that you'd normally do. Comment, ding buttons, subscribe, follow, watch us on TikTok. Um, we have a whole bunch of shorts that occasionally drop out every now and again. We're nutty cluster. Um, clipping, clipping, that's the word. Clipping us. Uh, so keep an eye out for those. Follow us on Facebook. And, um, yeah, stay cool until next week, because that's it. We'll be back, same time, same place, next week, Monday at 7 o'clock. Um, until then, see you later.